ready, sir. All right. My name is Dwayne Carraway, Deputy Mayor, Pro Tem of the City of Dallas. Let me just very quickly tell you why it is so very important that we go out and vote no for the convention center hotel. Uh, it is confusing when I say go vote no for the convention center hotel. We didn't write that language. That language was written to create confusion. It would have been very simple for us to say go vote yes so we can keep Dallas moving. But instead, because of the type of fight that we're in and the confusion that the opposition wants to bring about on this referendum, uh, we're having to have to say vote no. So first, we are stressing, and I am, that we go out and vote no. Why vote no for progress? Vote no for progress and vote no for our future. The younger people, the younger folks in this city, if we do not go out in mass numbers, if you do not punch your emails and send text messages and get your friends involved and go out and vote no for this hotel, that means that the way you see Dallas today is the way that you will see Dallas 50 years from now. Now go back to what I just said. The way that you see Dallas today, if you do not go out and defeat this proposition and vote no, will be the way that you in 2020, 2030, 2040. That is the makeup that this city will have. And it is very important that you don't put a salary cap or allow a salary cap to be placed on your future, your city, and the things that you would like to see as it relates to you competing with other cities across America. Other cities have convention center hotels. What is a convention center hotel? It's simply a hotel that's connected to the convention center. Why is that the thing to do today? Well, go back and remember when we first had cellular cell telephones. We had those cellular phones that had those big phones in the bags that we used to have to carry. Those big old phones that was larger than this antenna, I mean, than this, than this microphone that we used to have to walk and talk with. But today's technology brought us to this type of a cell phone, one that's like a razor, the iPhone. Those types of technologies are popular today. Well, I took you there because a convention center hotel is the type of hotel that's popular today. So other competitive cities that have convention center hotels, because they have them, that's where the conventions are going to where that popular type and style of hotel is located. Well, if we don't have it here in Dallas, then that means that we're not popular. It's just as simple as that. If we don't have it here in Dallas, that also means that we're gonna have to raise taxes. And we're gonna have to raise taxes because the Convention Center Hotel it helped offset the costs that the visitors that are visiting our city are here and they're spending their dollars today where we don't have to spend them and we utilize their dollars to pay for our police, to pay for fixing our streets, to pay for city services and all those types of things. It is very, very important that we stay visionary here in Dallas and you, the young folks, have to do that. We lost the Cowboys because we had no vision. We lost the Texas Rangers. We lost the, the, the baseball stadium, the, the horse race track, the, the race cars, because we were not visionary and did not step up to the plate. We must step up to the plate, hit this home run, vote no for the Convention Center Hotel so Dallas can stay on the leading edge and not become the ghost town because we were too we were, we were too short-sighted to step up and protect our city and protect your future. Vote no. I'm Dwayne Carraway, Deputy Mayor of the City of Dallas. Long-winded, but long-winded with a good message. Vote no.